Not again, Snickobolus on MTG Unpacked. We're unpacking three packs from the 2011 core set. And he's blessing or cursing him, but you know what? I think we're done with him for the time being. Unless there are some really good pulls in this episode, in which case he may return at some point. But I think we have had enough of Mr. Bolus for the time being. Alright, we get a Phantom Beast, Garuk's Companion, Volshock Berserker, Cultivate, Liliana's Spectre, Ajani's Mantra, Armored Cancrix, Fling, Bog Raiders. Now what is going on here? We've got some shifty looking zombies in a sewer or something. I don't even want to know. And the uncommon is a stone golem. Back to nature. War priest of Thun. And an ancient hellkite is rare. This is a 6 6 for 7 mana with flying. And you can pay a mountain. Ancient hellkite deals 1 damage to target creature defending player controls. Activate this ability only if ancient hellkite is attacking. So Mr. Bolus would be appreciative of that, but he's been exiled. He won't be coming back for a while. Okay, tips and tricks. So they're talking about new magic expansions, talking about Gatherer. Okay, um, I would recommend Scryfall as well. That one's pretty cool. It seems to be a bit more flexible with the searching. And what is this? We get a... Foil Wall of Vines. Plant Wall has Defender, Creature Can't Attack, and Reach Can't Block Creatures with Flying. Like all jungle plants, the vines must fight and claw for sunlight. Once their place is secured, they grow strong, sharp, and impenetrable. So this one only costs one forest, so zero three. Get a bunch of those out, and your opponent will say, oh no, some plants. What am I going to do? How, that, how am I going to get through that? Leave a note in the comments if I'm horribly mistaken and those are actually very good. We've got a Canyon Minotaur. Assassinate. Wild Griffin. Negate. Mighty Leap. Nether Horror. Lightning Bolt. There we go, there's two bucks. Disentomb. Demolish, Armoured Cancrix, and the uncommon is Rise from the Grave, Relentless Rats, for a second there I thought that was a Jackalope, that would have been a little disturbing, or more disturbing than it already is, Fire Servant, and a Mythic Bane Slayer Angel. With flying, first strike, lifelink, protection from demons and from dragons. There you go, Nicol Wallace. He's not worried about you. So 5-5 five, five for 5. Seems pretty cool. A lot of abilities there. And a swamp. And a bird token. Okay, last pack. Let's see what we get. We get an Azura Drake, Barony Vampire, Manic Vandal, Ice Cage, Cancel, Duress, Squadron Hawk, Goblin Tunneler. And I've got to look at the goblins because they're probably one of my favourite tribes in all of Magic. Jace's Erasure, Plummet. And the uncommon is a Black Knight, Pyroclasm, Diabolic Tutor, and the rare is a Stormtide Leviathan. So this is an 8 8 for 8 with Island Walk. This creature is unblockable as long as defending player controls an island. So all lands are islands in addition to their other types. Creatures without flying or Island Walk can't attack. So he's a dirty big fish. Uh, you would, uh, I don't know, is he, he's a little more expensive than a Fleet Swallower, but he's probably better. He has this Island Walk ability, so not bad at all. We get a forest, and what are we learning about today? 
We're learning about tokens and counters. Some abilities tell you to put a creature token on the battlefield and some abilities tell you to put a counter on a permanent. So if you want to read about that, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, freeze flame, flame, freeze frame that and take a closer look. And maybe they'll bring those back in the 2019 core set. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings and have a great day.